Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we have something different. We are talking about MIUI 13 applications. We're going to look at the gallery, the gallery editor and the launcher. Mostly these are the APKs which you'll see MIUI 13 with a lot of changes here and there. So in today's video, we're going to see how to install the launcher and the new gallery and what are the new features and what devices are supported and what not. But before we get into all of that, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. In the description of each video, you will find the link to our Telegram community where more than a thousand like-minded people chatting with each other. So join us there. Last but not the least, if you think the hard work is worth the effort, please click on the join button and support the channel. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Phone Ops. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right, so right off the bat, these are three APKs that you have to install. You don't need root access. As far as my understanding goes, you should be on MIUI 12.5. I'm not sure if it will work on MIUI 12 devices. And I would recommend you to use this on mid range like the Redmi Note series and the high end devices like the 11X or the Mi 11 and stuff like that. Because the basic devices like the Redmi 9A and stuff might not really have these many features supported because they don't really have that much horsepower in them. Now, first things first, let me show you the name of these applications. So first that you have over here is Gallery Alpha version 2.3.1, Gallery Editor version 0.2, and MIUI Launcher Alpha version this. So remember, most of the applications are saying Alpha because the MIUI 13 team has started working towards it and things will keep changing. And as and when we keep getting these updates to these particular applications, I will go ahead and share those particular new applications with you. Now, as I said earlier, this installation method is very simple. Just tap and install and you should be good to go right now let's talk about the features one by one so if you pinch to zoom just pay attention to the quick animation that you get over here it's bouncy and it's different as you can see now over here to the left you do have your themes button you have your widgets button again your MIUI 13 styled widgets which are really really smooth and moving on you do have your launcher settings over here no major changes in launcher settings you still have the minus one screen with google discover and stuff like that right so as far as the launcher settings is concerned you don't really have a lot of changes now apart from this if you have a look the moment you tap on this this particular menu that pops up again the animation is pretty smooth and pretty bouncy and there's no harm in trying this because as i said you can uninstall updates and it's not going to be an issue you'll get back to your stock launcher so this animation is pretty neat Another neat change that they've done is they have removed the blur. Now, some will like it, some will not. But remember, these, this might be a temporary change. They are still working on this. So you never know if they might bring in the blur back. Okay. Now, if you are someone who uses widgets, for example, let's go ahead and add a widget over here. There you go. So the widget addition animation is pretty good. So the animations are definitely improved. At the same time, if you press and hold on an application, you have app info and remove earlier, you had those options of, you know, uninstall and additional things like that. So those things are also there, but this animation is pretty, pretty neat. They are making changes to the animation, which makes you feel that the phone is not lagging, which is really, really good. Now, basically that was everything about the launcher. Let's go ahead and talk about the important part over here, the gallery. Now I have updated this gallery application and if you swipe all the way to the bottom, you will see that you have the cleaner, the trash bin and the trash folder option. So it will tell you which photos are recommended to be deleted in the cleaner and in the trash bin. If you've already deleted anything that will be displayed in the trash bin and then you have access to the trash folder as well. So that is something that has been added to the gallery application and moving on if you press this three dot menu you do get this map option over here it will ask you to download now this is alpha and this will currently only work for chinese users now it will show you this sort of a gallery map as you can see over here so you know as i said it is still in the alpha mode so things will get added now moving on let's go ahead and have a look at the gallery settings now before that you do see that you have map video editor collage clip magic art free up space sort list view and settings now these these particular options will vary from device to device because this is a Mi 11x you have these many options if you go to settings you do have sort of a new 
settings UI as well. It has select best photo, view hidden albums, convert the HEIF to JPEG before sending, and then you have gallery map privacy policy. So quite a lot of changes to the gallery application as well. And the animation in this particular launcher, just have a look at the app opening and closing animation. It's pretty, pretty subtle and pretty, pretty neat. Now the third and the last change. Now remember you installed the gallery editor APK. So if you take a screenshot and say you go to edit, you directly get this option of, you know, selecting a particular shade and then you can select a pen and do any sort of editing that you want. So basically earlier you used to get a different UI. Now you get a different UI over here. You have the share option as well and you have the save option as well. So you do have your new gallery editor which works in the screenshot mode, new animations in the launcher and new features being added to the gallery application as well. This was the quick look at these three applications which were recently updated. Let me know what do you think about these types of videos. I plan to make more of them so that you get access to the latest and newest features which are coming to MIUI 13. Until the next one, this is Kalash signing off at PhoneOps. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.